Hi, Natasha Pellick here. This episode of Eco Word is brought to you by WildGreenYonder.com. Did you ever go to the supermarket and even though people are growing local food, you're still seeing things from thousands and thousands of miles away? Well, doesn't that make you wonder what's going on with our economy? Anyway, uh, by now everybody knows that organic food, which uses no pesticides, hormones, uh, steroids and things like that, or other chemicals, is better for you and the environment. But the last couple of years, there's been another big trend in the way eco-conscious people eat, and it's going local, right? So visiting your farmer's market, I'm sure, is a practice that we all should preach, right? And it's a great way to get to know your farmers, which is somebody that you want to know, of course, because you're putting all this food into your body and you're running around and doing your job, and this is kind of how your whole body is working. So what is so special about local food? Well, for one thing, it surely tastes better. Ooh, the nutrients, mmm, I love it. Well, for one thing, I have to say for myself that the local growers are much, much better at what they do. You get to get to know them, they're amazing people. The shorter distance from the farm to your taste buds means that the food is much fresher. Ah, can you imagine that? <laughs> and it often is grown at a smaller family-based farm and it has a lot more care. They talk to their plants and stuff like that, you know? <laughs> it also means uh, a much smaller carbon footprint. Fewer miles means less fossil fuels are needed to bring it to you and to your family. Finally, by supporting local farmers and getting to know the seasonal rhythms of your local harvest, eating locally connects you with your community. Not a bad thing in a hyper-global world, right? One of the coolest innovations out of the local war movement is community-supported agriculture, CSA. Signing up with a CSA in your city is like subscribing to a farm for a season. You pay a farmer fee, 100 bucks up front or so, and it's basically like you're buying into a food bank. And you get a weekly box of fresh local produce delivered from the farm of your area. But even without a CSA, going local is easier than ever. A farmer's market starting up all over the country, and it's amazing. It's an amazing place to meet people and to kind of browse around and see who's out and about, and especially who's eco-conscious. <laughs> to find out about all the great op options of eating locally in your neck of the woods, log on to localharvest.org. So what are you waiting for? Bite in.